After the end of World War II, many African Americans and other blacks wanted the same things that white people had, the, which was the freedom for rights. Blacks didn't really have much of that. They were really annoyed about it. Um, the African Americans wanted ways to have good lives. They wanted good home space, ways to provide for their families, and wanted ways for their own kids to have equal education as other white kids did. Um, but during this time, it was very hard for the blacks to get and other African Americans to get what they wanted as easily as the whites did. For the whites, these dreams were very simple to them. They were easy to get them, but for the blacks it was different because just that they were a different color. Um, Africans Americans were not the only people at this time who wanted to have some sort of freedom. Um, Asian Americans and Latinos also wanted to pursue their own dreams with no problem because of their race. During World War II, many African Americans had many successful campaigns for rights. These campaigns were waged to stop the discrimination against um, blacks and many African Americans who helped win um, World War II went home to the South also hoping to win their freedom of equal rights. One of the main things these African Americans wanted was the right to vote and be in other um, campaigns for politics. One of these factors was many factors led to the president making a decision to finally help the blacks gain their rights. One of these factors was when a senator from Mississippi ran for a democratic re-election. He, this um, democratic re-election, um, he said that the easiest way to stop the blacks from running was to see them the night before, indicating that the whites would most likely attack the blacks before they could have a chance to run for whatever they wanted to run for. Um, the act, this act allowed uh, for President Truman to create the President's Committee on Civil Rights. One sign that helped show that black rights were changing was when an African American baseball player was able to enter the major leagues um, for baseball. Soon after, many more campaigns were seen to stop segregation everywhere. The main areas in included schools and buses. After World War II, many African Americans moved to the West, which expanded black population in the West from 4.9% to 5.4%, which was about 1 million um, African American or black people in the, in the West. Because of the high population, many boycotts were present um, due to segregation. After many years of struggle, um, African Americans were finally able to get the equal white rights they've been wanting for many years. Um, many black people were killed in the process, but it was an overall good change for the United States and it helped um, many groups to be able to change and grow closer together as there were more um, people involved for it.